Hello reality viewers, welcome back again to Reality Latest G's, the home of news and politics. For this channel, we they drop news every day and we they react to every video where it comes our way. And our reality news now we they drop for this channel and we they also they talk um, as it be. If today now the first time we say they come across this channel, you are highly welcome. Thank you so much for stopping by. And if you are returning subscribers, I appreciate all of you now for now massive support to this channel. I say may God bless all of you now in Jesus name. Amen. I get video away I want to present to Una this very moment. And I go to follow now. They watch the video. After we don't watch them together, make we drop our opinion constructively for the comment section. Like our videos and also share our videos if possible. Bye for now. Now good morning. Uh, this is now BBC News PJ. Uh, we did live for Abuja for the Federal High Court for Abuja where uh, I pop leader Namdekanu's trial they resume today. The life for Abuja right now for the Federal High Court for the headquarters and the trial of Namdekanu they resume today, November 10. Uh, as now they see, um, as usual, every security day ground for the front of the court. Uh, so many security personnel now in there for the front of the court. Uh, the trial of uh, the leader of the indigenous people of Biafra, Namdekanu, they resume today in Gosho to in the show for a trial to answer the charges where Nigeria government within Samaram just to join us this now BBC News Beijing we did here to give an update on what in the happen for the Federal High Court today uh, make her just run on our truth so it never starts but then we get here and we go soon the court session will soon start All right, eh, as soon as they join us for this live, so remember to set your notifications. See, anytime we BBC Pigeon, they go live means Facebook for last you because we do get they, they give on an update and eh, back to back on top what they happen for here today. Uh, make I just run on a through um, the background to this um, trial, they've been done all before for last month, um, October. Uh, where Justice uh, Binta Yako, the judge, go to sit down for the case. Uh, all right, uh, they try to say, would like to say some people don't begin to enter the court right now. But then every security presence that uh, ended for the Federal High Court um, this morning. All right, make I just run on a true what will happen for here today. And uh, the leader of the indigenous people of Biafra and Africa will show for this court for a trial uh, to answer some of the charges with Nigeria government in Samaram. Um, Nigeria government in Samarkand with charges the way they related to, you know, alleged act of um, terrorism and uh, what they call a treasonable um, felony. The trial being first um, start for this court on July 26. That's not the first time where this trial start for the Federal High Court. Uh, but that day, no hold, sake of say, the Department of um, State Security uh, will be DSS. Uh, they no bring air cannot come this court that day is based on log some logistic reasons with inside. Uh, so the justice, Justice Pinta and Yako, now they sit down on top of the case. Uh, in court, say, you know, sit down on top of the matter. I joined the case till October 20, um, will be last month. But that October 20 cannot show for court that time and he plead not guilty to all the charges uh, with Nigeria government uh, been Samaram. I just born natural. Um, what's going to happen? So for that last time we're in show for court, uh, we'll be last 
month of October 20, um, Nigeria government, you know, based on seven count charges, make I just run on our through and uh, waited those seven count charges where Nam the Kano they face trial for. So they do in don't plead say uh, in no they guilty according to waiting in lawyers where they defend and don't talk. And uh, some of the charges that they uh, Nam the Kano they allegedly using radio broadcast uh, broadcast from London uh, to abuse Nigeria President uh, Muhammadu Buhari. Saying they call the presidents um, different names like pedophile, terrorist, idiot, and uh, a whole lot of. According to uh, waiting the judge, um, Samaram Sena, the accused with federal government the liberal. Another accused, we say they say Kanu, they allegedly uh, import radio transmitter uh, with them called TRAM 50L. They in the eight inside container to keep for uh, Hihala, that's not for Anambra State, that's not one of the uh, charges, that's not the second one. Another one we say Kanu allegedly they declare himself as a member of the indigenous people of Biafra, IPOP, and they say that group, uh, Nigeria government, is not banned the group, that's not the number three out of the seven count charges we Namdi Kanu they uh, face accused for today. Uh, they also say uh, Kanu allegedly committed terrorism when they used the broadcast uh, from London to encourage members of the members of IPOP um, to attack Nigeria's security operatives and their family members. Then uh, that's now another uh, uh, part of the charges we in the face for. But they do in don't plead guilty. In lawyers don't talk. Say these um, count charges you no know, old ground. Uh, or make I just give one uh, just uh, updates or uh, all right. I did try to say uh, what did happen. We see some of the security vehicles still they trooping. Uh, we don't see some of the lawyers them don't begin enter the premises of the court. But right now uh, they never still open the courts to press men. So now why we still get here uh, to give one a just the background to see how things be, um, how the surroundings, which is the environment today about this morning from the federal high court for Abuja where Namdi Kano uh, the face trial, trial would have been adjourned from October um, last month. All right, make I just, um, if you just join us, make I run out through the seven count charges again. Uh, the first one as they uh, Namdi Kano they're using radio broadcast from London to abuse Nigeria president. Another one say Kanu allegedly declared himself as members, a uh, member of indigenous people of Biafra, Ipo. They say Kanu allegedly again commit terrorism when he used the radio broadcast from London to encourage members of Ipo to attack Nigeria security operatives and their family. Uh, they also talk say Kanu allegedly commits terrorism when he both say things go happen and say some people go uh, die. Uh, another of the seven count charges now say him allegedly used the rape to and also threaten uh, death on people we know obey uh, the order. That's now another of those same um, seven count charges we in the face. But in lawyers, they don't argue, say their clients uh, will be named the canon, will be guilty of all these charges. One of the lawyers to canon will be barrister, if I age or for say uh, the. Uh, they challenge the charges which now part of which they all come do for this court this morning uh, he said the seven count of offense we got men some nam the can they baseless and worthless according to the rule of law according to what he talk the last time we then show for this court that's now october uh, last month october 20 he said the seven count charges will be any offense take our best no fee they sneeze for london where most of this offense where they say nam the can commits most of this offense they, that's no place this for London make it become offense uh, for Nigeria. As you can see, the case will continue today and we're here to give you all the updates and everything will happen for this court today. And of course, everything will go even happen outside of here. The last time we were been there here, uh, we see some of the supporters, IPOP support has been shown for this court and also some um, rights activists also show for this court. Um, the last time, that was now October 20, before they adjourned the case to today, November 10. Uh, so we did here to give an update on what they happen from inside the court, from outside the court, as who they show, who they show, and why, and what will happen, you know, what the judgments will be uh, today.
another case, another matter we did before this court. Now, uh, uh, matter we uh, Nam Dekanu lawyer don't raise really to make them uh, come out and from DSS custody. So maybe they allow me to transfer and go correctional center. Uh, but the judge uh, will be Justice Binta Yako where they preside on the case say, uh, case, say uh, no. Say uh, Nam Dekanu will still remain for uh, DSS custody. So I seem being still there for DSS custody. They expect they say and uh, DSS will still bring and come. Uh, today, if you just uh, join us, this is not BBC News PG. And uh, we did for the trial of Nam Dekanu for the Federal High Court headquarters. We did for Abuja, uh, where the trial of the uh, leader of the indigenous people of Bihafra uh, will take place and will resume today. So, if you just uh, join us, uh, make I just run on through the highlight again. Uh, we see some. People, all right, no declare who they be, but we will still follow them. Talk the last time, uh, supporters of IPOP been show for this court. Uh, the last time will be October 20. We can plead not guilty uh, to terror charges with federal government um, in Samaram and a uh, treasonable felony, according to waiting then talk every security presence as usual and here we did see for here uh, since the case since the matter don't start for july 26 it's supposed to be the first day of the trial but then uh, canon uh, nam the canon no show for court they call and join the case to october 20 when justice being tired because they she not be preside on case way with the answer questions or answer the matter no day for court. All right, make uh, we just try to see some of the people we don't give for front of the court today. Uh, which they go on can be. Some people don't they gather for here. Anytime for me. Anytime from now, uh the trial for Nambu Kano Gustav for this court. Maybe we see some of the people. We're going to show face for here this morning. Why don't they here? And then be, we will follow some of them. So, Now BBC News Pigeon, we did live for Abuja where Nam the Kano trial it happened. Traditional rulers. I believe you. Traditional rulers from um, the southeast. Good morning, sir. Hey. Okay. Uh, so you can introduce yourself and tell us um, what you did for this court this morning, sir. We're gonna wake up when you. All right, uh, like talk, but now this now some leaders from the southeast, traditional leaders from the southeast. Come here. 
All right, some security officers may say there's a stay for around the court. <laughs> Traditional leaders from South East show. No, but don't ask us to go to Nigeria. I need to be But I want to work in. Oh, why is it not the time? Now that I'm from where? Why not I need to work there? That's all. No, no, no. All right, sir. For some of us, we no understand uh, Igbo. If you feel speak English or Pidgin, if you feel speak English or Pidgin, uh, for some of the audience, we no understand uh, Igbo. Tell us your name. Uh, who you... Oh, okay, okay. Then you feel tell us just about what's in. Please, 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 as well as others from communities, legal speaking areas in Nigeria. We are here because a father does not abandon his son or daughter. So we are here for Imam Bikam is our son. And we cannot abandon him as we are father. That's our duty in Igbo tradition. Thank you. We have one. If you want an interview, come to my palace. Everybody. All right, um, so we're going to the talk they say they day here. That's now part of their, their tradition uh, to come here to support um, their son. Support their son uh, will be Namdi Kanu, then be royal fathers uh, from the south east of Niger uh, Nigeria. Say that's not their duty to come here to support him today. We uh, in trial they continue for this court. Uh, from what we talk, um, Nigeria government and uh, Kanu uh, on seven count charges were based on terrorism and a uh, treasonable felony. So we day here uh, to see how the trial they go. BBC News Pigeon. Um, we day here. If you miss any of this, if you enter our website and to read more about how this trial don't go so far, how the arrest they happen, how the trial don't go so far since July 27, and uh, we enter October 20 last month, and uh, before they even adjourn and come today, and uh, we'll be November 10. Uh, Justice Binta Iyako, where they sit down, top the matter, adjourn the case to today. And then we go see how uh, the whole process um, go turn out. Uh, before I let you now go, uh, so that we go still resume later to give you more updates, uh, make I just then um, give you an hint on waiting these um, seven count charges uh, day about. But we still day here as people they come. Uh, if you see supporters and if you see people from the other side of the government, uh, we will go follow talk and give us. Uh, ends on waiting day with the expect to happen for the federal high court today uh, we will still be given that update so make you set your notification say uh, make facebook alert you anytime bbc news pigeon go live today for this court so that you will feel the catch the updates as you go and when you enter court when the judge judgment starts uh trial so to say when it starts so that you feel the uh they go feed the update to you as you go. Uh, make I just run on through the seven count charges we uh not the kind of lawyer they defend I'm saying you know they're guilty of uh, but then the trial they continue today. Um Nigeria government they say um can allegedly using radio broadcast for long zone. Uh, where he used to say he to separate the south, east, south, south, and so part of them, um, um, Kogi, Benue State from Nigeria to form Biafra land. That's not part of the offense. 
um, with federal government say in comment. They also say Kanu allegedly declare himself um, as a member of uh, indigenous people of Biafra. That's not a group we Nigeria government is already banned. Uh, say uh, they no get rights um, to that group for Nigeria. They also say he allegedly uh, committed terrorism when he used the radio broker from London to you know encourage uh, members of the band hip hop um, to attack Nigeria security security operatives and members of their family uh which we see now say people soon they gather from here see as things they go for the federal high court at Ninja, where none they can try the resume today Canon lawyers on top of the seven count charges with them. Some around, they don't say the, um, that they challenged the charges with than they expected to um, do for court. Uh, one of the lawyers, a uh, fine age of four, say, uh, say the seven count offense with government, some around the canon say it is baseless according to the rule of law. That's now waiting in John Hagi so far. All right, so stay tuned to BBC News PGN. Set your notification because as soon as things they happen for here, uh, where people they gather for here, uh, we go to update you now. Make we see some of the people they don't come. So fast, every security they on grind front of the court. So just set your notification. Set your notification. Uh, we will be updating now as the trial to go. And if you miss anything, enter bbcbooking.com for the website to read more about waiting don't happen since this trial starts for July 6th.